Hey, what's going on guys? It is Lasty here and welcome to episode number 31 of the Random Pick. First off, if you guys are looking to buy any coins, go and check out the FIFAshop.co.uk. Use my code LA5TY, that'll get you a 5% discount and the link is down below in the description for you. As always, if this video could smash a like, 2,000 would be absolutely awesome. I'd really appreciate that for you guys. And we actually get a page number one to start things off. Rooney is the highest rated card, but I see a sneaky inform Thierry Henry over there. At the time of recording this, the team of the season version wasn't out. Uh, so this was his highest rated card that we could have possibly got at the time. Uh, but we get Thierry Henry as our first player. Xavi and Iniesta are the highest rated players on page number six. But I decided to go for this guy, Top Rack, because I I think I've used Xavi and Iniesta before, uh, and Top Rack looks to be a fairly decent centre-back. Moving on, third one is actually only a page number seven as well, which is crazy. Loads of informs to choose from. Highest rated player is James Rodriguez transfer card, but I really wanted to use this guy, Adrian Ramos. Never used him before, heard some very good things, so I thought I'd try him out today. Now, those are our three inform random pick players today, uh, and we're going to go with a 4 triple two, mainly for chemistry reasons you know those three players are actually not the easiest to stick in a squad together so uh, we'll see what we come up with in just a second i pick a Thierry up for 22k ish something like that just under uh, in the obviously the striker position um pick up a top rack for 54k something like that um which is very expensive actually it never was that much back in the day but this market man it's crazy uh, and then we pick up a ramos for exactly the same as what we paid for Adrian, uh, no, for Top Brack. So this is where each of the three players are going to be playing. Left striker for Ramos, right striker for Henri, and the squad around them looks like this. So a total of around 275k. So a nice cheaper squad for you guys today if you would like to build that. We've got the main man, Neuer, in goal. Um, he's just the best. I love him. Absolutely love him. Um, Alaba and Franklin. As our left back and right back, Alaba obviously got a lot better stats than Franklin. Uh, Brooks looks to be an incredible centre back. 74 pace, 73 defending, 76 heading. Can't wait to use him. Uh, Omar Tote back then. His first in form has got 78 pace, 83 dribbling, and 81 heading. Medium, medium work rates, and he's six foot one as well. Fairly decent stats there for an 80 rated card, and I look forward to playing with him today. We've got two non rare Americans as our CDMs, but one plays in the Bundesliga. Ziga, one plays in the MLS, and that is Bradley and Jones. Now, Sakam today, we've got uh, Tim Cahill, regular card, and the 75 rated Ronnie as well. Um, both fairly slow, but I needed them for chemistry, unfortunately. Adrian Ramos then, our second random pick player and our first striker of the team. 87 pace, 76 shooting. 87 headings. So, what we're going to be looking to do with him is head the ball into the back of the net. And then Thierry Henry, a little bit more flair about him. Four star skills and weak foot. He's got the 85 dribbling and the 82 shooting. But he's lacking a little bit on pace nowadays. Bless him. Um, but again, I'm looking, I'm, I'm looking forward to using his team of the season at some point uh, because he looks to be a pretty decent card. But moving on into the clips for this episode then. Brooks, what a man. He was just ridiculous. Um, he annihilates top rack. He really does. Look at that for a header into the back of the net. That is just crazy. Uh, and then Bradley then getting through. He scored a goal. Actually, a fair few players in this team scored because Jermaine Jones is about to score as well. He just cuts it back in the 120th minute and finesses that one past the keeper for a late, late win. Oh, they feel so good. Uh, playing it through to Tim Cahill then. He slotted that one home quite nicely. And again, he's got a team in the season that I could do with using at some point as well. Uh, Ronnie. Ronnie's got the left foot of God. Take a look at that for a smasher. And you don't think that one's good? Well, this one's a little bit better. We just just use a little bit of that. Oh, yes. What a beautiful goal that was from Ronnie. Um, but Ramos then, obviously big in the air. He scored one for me in the air like that. But I've got to say, I struggled a lot with this team. Now, I played my usual, what, seven games or so. And I didn't do too well. You know, we, we score in these goals that you're seeing right now. But... I've got to say, I struggled. Um, Ramos, I liked him, but he was 
a fairly decent member of a fairly weak team, in my opinion. Uh, Henri was alright, but he's sort of lacking something nowadays. He really is. Uh, probably pace. <laughs> Back in the day, you could, you could have blitzed past the defenders right there. But as you see, we're sort of struggling with it. Uh, and then... This particular effort right here is just a great run in the box. And that's what I know Thierry for. Outside of the boot, banging it into the back of the net. But I didn't experience too much of that throughout this um, throughout this game, unfortunately. So, in goal, Neuer. Yeah, obviously amazing. He's a great goalkeeper on this game. Uh, made it to my number two. And he's actually my favourite, you know, just regular goalkeeper on the game. Not team of the season or anything like that. Left back and right back did all right. I've got to say, Alaba's all right, but Franklin was pretty good. Brooks, amazing. Absolutely loved him. Uh, top rack gets annihilated by Brooks all day, every day. He's all right. Not worth 54.5k. So I'm going to give him a three-star value for money and a 7.5 out of 10. You know, average. That's, that's an average score um, in this episode. Moving on to the midfielders then. Uh, Jermaine Jones is very good. Bradley, again, also really awesome. I want to try out his blue card as well at some point. Um, he could make this squad really nice if you use the blue card. Someone do that and show me on Twitter. That would be awesome of you guys. Uh, Ronnie was amazing. Cahill was average. Uh, I wasn't expecting Ronnie to be so good. He's got free kick stats for days as well, if you guys have never tried him. So Thierry Henry, three goals in seven games. That is shocking. Uh, going to give him a three-star value for money and only a 6.5 out of 10. I hate to do it, Thierry, but you just weren't cutting it for me in this particular episode. I'm sorry. And then Ramos, only three goals in seven games as well. But he does get five assists, and I did actually fairly enjoy playing with him. So he gets a three-and-a-half star value for money and a 7.5 out of 10. Again, very, very average. Uh, but I think I just got a bum deal with this particular squad this time. I came up against... Some decent opponents. I uh, wasn't playing the best myself also, and I'm not used to the formation. So it was always going to be a tough one. Uh, but if you've enjoyed the episode, guys, I'd really appreciate a like. That would be awesome. Um, try this squad out if you fancy it. Who knows if you'd like it or not. But I appreciate you guys watching, and I will catch you next time. Peace.